Okay, welcome back uh, to The Legend of Zelda, and this could be the final part. I'm not really sure. It really depends on how far I'm going to need in order to get to level 4 and uh, level 7. But the reason is, is because uh, in order to defeat Ganon, I need to get the bow. I have the Iron Arrow, which I got from the uh, from the dungeon a little while back, but the problem is, is that... Yeah, I don't really have a bow to use it, so, like, I can't really defeat Ganon or, or anything in that, uh, respect or anything, so. Anyways, I'm gonna, like, just head straight past here, so I, I don't want to deal with these darkness. Like, that's one of the things I don't really like about this game is, yeah, I just uh, don't want to deal with it or anything. Okay, so I got a, I got a small key, which is a nice start. Okay, I gotta stop <laughs> frolicking all over the place and actually play the game. Okay. Yeah, Alright, there we go. So we got the small key down. Okay, so anyways, uh, I found level 4 in the very, very last hole I expected. And the other problem is, though, too, is that I don't remember at all that, that the level 4 dungeon or that the hole that I burned down uh, actually existed in this place. So, uh, it, it, it was kind of funny because, like, you know, like, sometimes when you scour, like, overworlds or something and you feel like you got 100% of everything and then... You kind of double check the map and you still feel like you've got everything but still you couldn't find the map or the dungeon and you're just like man where 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 is it and i just had to like like look like super super closely at the map and i finally found it but i'm like i don't remember at all ever 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 in the first quest that the the that there was happened to be a staircase over in this direction i'll actually show you when i get back uh, into the other room but let's see, um, I guess I gotta do fight the Dark Nuts, huh? Oh shoot, uh, well, I don't really, it's kind of like the layout of the room that's really bothering me, is that it doesn't really give you a lot of room to maneuver. So let's see, so, uh, thankfully the, the, the corner guys don't really bother me too much, but the Dark Nuts do. Okay, so let's see, ah, darn it, I was hoping. Alright, hold on, okay, I gotta look at the corners uh, a little bit more, so to... Because, like, maneuvering... Oh, never mind. <laughs> I got myself a little cheat sheet here. Oh, thank goodness, though, too. Because, um, yeah. Dark nuts and stuff like that. Not really my thing. Okay. So, I got another small key, at which I can use this uh, for the door north of here. But I don't actually know if there's a Triforce in this room. So, I have to fight these dark nuts. And, thankfully, they're the orange kind. So, let's see. So, if I could do this just right. Let's see. Oh, I don't want to keep on using bombs though because uh, yeah, they're used uh, in order to open up doors So I don't really want to like abuse them. Oh, well, especially for this part. Okay and It feels like that's the only way you can really fight them. It's just get up into their faces and just Yeah, just hit them like this. Okay. Yep, and then Yep, okay. Okay, so there isn't anything here. So don't have to worry about that And part of the reason I'm not really too worried is that I have a lot of hearts. So that's a really nice thing Okay, so the level 4 dungeon, um, it's not actually too big, so that is the good news, but the problem is, is that I'm actually ab about to run out of small keys here, uh, actually, so, oh darn it, there's not really anything I can do, huh? So I guess I'm gonna have to come back later, I suppose, after I get myself uh, some small keys, I suppose, unless this, uh, unless this can get me something, but, nope, uh, I got nothing. But I seriously do need the bow in order to uh, finish the game, though, or to defeat Ganon. So, uh, I think, uh, yeah, it was right here. Like, I could have sworn in all of the time that I played The Legend of Zelda in 2016, I never thought that there was a staircase there. So, I guess you learn something new every day. But still, though, trying to scavenge, like, every single hole for, like, about three or four parts, and then you finally find it, it's like, oh, man, it just makes you feel like an idiot. <laughs> Okay, so before I head into Dungeon 9, uh, because there are two still two hidden items in there, and I didn't really see the guy in the front, uh, the guy that requires you to get the eight Triforce pieces in order to progress further into the dungeon, I did not see him there. Probably because the place is randomized on where you start in the dungeon. But uh, regardless though, I do need some bombs in order to get myself around that place. And there are a lot of bombable places in Dungeon 9, that's for sure. And then uh, the rest is just going to have to come, yeah, like with get, getting rupees and uh, getting like 91 rupees in order to... Or unless I can find the master key, that that can work too. Let's see, I hope that these guys can drop some bombs for me, but... Well, now that I said that, it's not going to. And I can't go without bombs. Um, I'm going to 
I'm gonna head across the beach actually and uh, get myself some bombs and I can't believe it's actually doing this to me. It's actually disappointing. Because I really do need some bombs. Let's see. Oh, uh, where? Uh, these guys aren't gonna drop bombs because they're not blue. Okay, these guys are blue. Are you gonna give me some bombs? Oh, nope. Oh, I got five rupees. Well, that's a start. <laughs> oh, in the long run though, probably not. Okay. Hey! Okay, stop. Man, are, I gotta find a second place to start uh, farming for some bombs. This is like, can't, okay. Okay, I gotta get them back on land, so just in case they, nope, that's not gonna work. Now that I froze them. These guys drop bombs. Oh, there we go. We got four. I wanna get at least eight, though. Uh, hearts, that's not gonna help. I need bombs. I need some bombs. Please get me some bombs. You know, there's something else that's coming across my mind that might finish this randomizer of faster than I thought. Is that maybe it isn't required, uh, like with to defeat Ganondorf in order to in order to beat the game. So maybe I can just find Zelda or something like out of the blue. And if that's the case, then I probably wasted a lot of my time with the parts and stuff. But in the last time with the Maelstrom difficulty, it was required to get all eight because of that guy in the entrance. Remember? remember well, that was a long time ago. I, <laughs> I wouldn't expect you to remember back that far, but. Um, uh, yeah, that is, uh, that is one of the main features of the Maelstrom difficulty, is that you need to get all eight Triforce pieces to enter the ninth dungeon, but I didn't see any, uh, such guy, uh, when I was, uh, going through it last time, so, I don't know, it could be similar, it could be different, I don't know, only one way to find out, I suppose, and, um, I really do need some bombs, there we go, okay, at least eight, if I can get at least eight, that would be wonderful. Okay, so let's head into Dungeon 9, and this is going to be the part where it is very possible where this could be the very last part because of, I don't know how the Maelstrom difficulty got configured with the yeah with the new version and everything. Okay, so I do know where it's at. It's actually over here to the left a little bit. I remember these guys like to come up a lot with the in this area. I'm getting a fair amount of rupees. If I can get just a few more, then oh, that would be great. Okay, so here we go. I think this is Dungeon 9 right here, actually. Yep, here we go. Dungeon 9, and it's very eerie. <laughs> okay, so... There's nothing here. So, what we gotta do is start bombing uh, some entrances here anyways. In order to get deeper into the place. Okay, um... Uh, book, oh, crap. I do need them. Ah. Okay, man. I, I, so, it is very faithful to the Maelstrom difficulty part with that. Um... With that part, anyways. Um, let's see. Uh, don't worry. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna like wander off on a rupee farm yet. I'm actually gonna head back to Dungeon Seven really quick and uh, see if I can find the item again. And I said the earlier that well, like when I saw the Goma, I saw a little pushable block that could lead to an item congreg congregation. So that was what uh, discouraged me from uh, getting into it. Well, let's see. Let's get into here again. And let's see if we can find the item this time. Okay, so it's not it's not going to be a waste of time. Okay, so we got Triforce. Okay, so let's see here. We got a... Let's see. It looks like the... I, I think I've actually tried some bombable places up here in, into the north. So what I want to do is uh, head over... Oh, I wasn't expecting them to zone in on me like that. Oh, well. Okay, so let's keep on going through. Okay, okay. I get it, guys. I see if I can get just eight more rupees, I can get myself a small key to progress further in a uh, in dungeon four. So this this might not be the final part because of this. Well, it does and I know that's a shortcut. Uh, I think that goes one room to the north though, so I think it's actually super redundant. <laughs> yeah, it actually just goes right here. So what's really the point, you know? Okay, and I've already checked to the north of there. I remember that. But I haven't checked, uh, well, I'm remembering the creature layout of the dungeon uh, with Dungeon 7 is that a good part of the upper half has been filled in, but not the lower half. So that's kind of making me think that I got to start uh, heading into the lower half of the place and start bombing the place. Okay, uh, let's see. I think you got to push a block or, uh, yeah, like, there's no enemies here. So, like, oh, there is enemies. Oh, shoot. Well, I was trying, but I got jinxed at the last second. Okay, come on. Let's see. I think I'm... No, I'm not quite towards the lower half yet. 
That's where I want to save my bombs. Okay, here we go. I gotta be careful just in case they pop out of that same place. Okay, I gotta get away from the walls and I got jinxed again. Oh, I'm trying to, but they keep on fading in. Oh, darn it. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Oh, the one time, like, I'm not usually fearful of Master of Hands because they're so easy to contain, but because I got jinxed and bu got bounced into that stupid Master Hand, then all of a sudden, it uh, just restarts everything. Well, I got rupees to compensate, but uh, that's not going to help. Come on, let's get this done. Seriously. Oh, I'm kind of anxious to get this uh, game done, though, too. Because, uh, the... Well, like, it usually doesn't take more than six or seven parts in order to get one of these uh, randomizers done. So I am, am kind of anxious to kind of get some progress going. And, well, it's kind of like heading towards the final hurdle, you know? Just I, I'm just as anxious as you are to get everything done. And, come on, I, it's because of these stupid jinxing things that... And now I have to wait for the whole set to appear again. I guess I gotta wait in the center until they pop up, I suppose. Okay, well, there's one, and now I gotta wait, like, an eternity for the others. Are you gonna come or not? Do I have to, like, get closer or something to make them appear, or what? Okay, okay, don't bop me into the Master Hand. Okay, there's more, and I think there's, like, two more. Oh, man, I almost got caught again. Alright, there we go. So, he's down now. Okay, so let's head right, and then let's head down. Yep, and I think this is where Goma is, which there's nothing I can do here. Okay, I don't have the bow, so I can't fight him. Okay, so let's, uh, yep, this is... I, I don't want to keep on getting jinxed and everything. Okay. Alright, so this is, uh, this is kind of where I'm starting to think that there might be some hidden hole or something around here. And if not, then I'm going to look it up, because uh, this is, this is kind of tiring me out. Come on. Come on, we got to get the item from here. Or, yep, yeah, I got enough rupees to get a small key at least. Nope, nothing right there. Oh, yes, I got a bombable hole down towards the south. All right. Oh, that isn't... Is that an item congregation? I hope it's not a shortcut. I hope that does lead to the bow. I really do need the bow, most of all. So if I don't get the bow, then I am... I'm done for. This run is dead. Oh, well, I found the item. I got enough to buy one small key, too, so I can progress in uh, level 4 a little bit. I just hope it's enough. I thought that I would get enough small keys, like, overall, to help me get through, like, every dungeon. But, oh, man, those small keys go fast. Um, while I'm here, that might be a good idea to sc scour, scrounge around a little bit and see if I can get some small keys uh, from, the, from the place. Because that is a very good idea, because... Like, uh, but I'm not going to use it on that small do uh, on that door right there, because that'd be redundant. And, Using a small key to get another small key, that that doesn't make so much sense. So let's go down here a little bit more. Let's... Oh, shoot. There's a... Oh, don't tell me there's more of those hands around. Are you serious? Oh, man. These guys, like, kill the pace, don't they? Oh, man. Are you kidding me? Oh. Wow. Am I seriously locked in here? <laughs> just right as soon as I bomb it then man I, it's kind of funny that the biggest threat from these guys is just trying my patience oh the rupees are helping okay oh, I barely saw him so oh heart container so definitely not a waste of time that was definitely good I explored but my problem hasn't been solved yet though I need small keys though uh, that's my that, that's my next chick <laughs> that's my next plan of attack Okay, um, let's see, those things do shoot, okay. But, uh, thankfully, though, I don't have to worry about them too much. They got the blue boomerang, so they can sh throw it a little, oh, there we go. Now, I'm not going to use it on that small key. I'm going to use it for dungeon four. Okay, how close is dungeon four from here? Uh, quite a bit, that's okay, we still got plenty of time. So I might be able to, uh, so I got dungeon seven done, which is good, so I don't have to come back into here. But now, I got to get dungeon four done. 
And then after that, we can head into Dungeon 9. So I'm actually really gr grateful that they kept that part faithful with the Maelstrom difficulty. Is that it's required to get every single Triforce piece in order to get into Dungeon 9. So that way you don't get the easy way out, you know. And I'm also gr grateful that the item congregation uh, didn't end up at the other place. Um, Let's see. I remember. It's going left and then going up. It's a good thing I, I've been in this dungeon enough. I know where... Okay. Oh, good. Just one Kese. That takes care of that part. <laughs> it's, uh, I'm still laughing about that shortcut there. <laughs> Just one room over. I call that a shortcut. <laughs> uh, reminds me of a joke. But... Uh, anyways, that's not relevant. Let's go. All right, let's go. All right, so the Triforce piece is in here. That's right. But I already got all the Triforce pieces except for Dungeon 4. So that's really the only place I left to go. Almost done. Almost done. We are almost there. Uh, well, let's see. So I can use my wands like mercilessly now since I got the fire attachment to it, but... Uh, yeah, though, that is the that is the next problem, though, is that I don't have the bow, and I need some small keys, so I'm hoping that I can get bailed out of this one. And if I don't, then uh, uh, then I'm probably going to have to search the overworld, I suppose, in order to find it. Let's see. I think the only items I don't really have left is the orange candle and the bow. So I'm probably guessing that those are in Dungeon 9, actually, so... But the thing is with the randomizer, though, is that it won't trap the bow in a place where I can't get to it. Like, if it happens to be behind a G Goma enemy. So, I'm probably guessing the last items to get is the the last one in a Dungeon 4, then the last two to get in Dungeon 9. So, I don't have the orange candle. Yep, don't have the orange candle. and I Oh, and I don't have the master key. So, those, those are the three remaining items I don't have is the master key, the orange candle, and the bow. So, they have to be... In these uh, dungeons, they have to be, because I've checked everywhere, overworld, and, and the such. Let's see, and I don't think these guys give off a small key. Doesn't hurt to check though. Okay, and thankfully dungeon four is not very big either, so I don't need a whole lot of small keys. And darn it, I should have I should have bought another small key, uh, just in case uh, to avoid backtracking. Okay, hopefully these guys can give me a small key, triforce, anything. Okay, so I'm gonna get aggressive on these guys. Okay, takes care of him. Okay. Got him. Okay, that takes care of that. Let's see, that's the way out of here. That uh, gap that goes over to the right. So I can keep on uh, progressing. I do remember what Dungeon 4 looks like because it is my favorite dungeon from this game. Okay, so I know that just going north will solve a lot of my problems. Okay. <laughs> nice. Nice. Uh, and these guys are trying to corner me a little bit. Okay. Oh, good. I got my little cheat code. All right. Cool. Let's see. Small key. Yes. Small key. Yes. Yes. <laughs> oh, booyah. Anything to keep me going. And then I got to be careful as I find the lo locked doors, though, too, because it, they could be redundant small doors, though, too. Like, I can use a bomb or something to get around them. So I got to watch out for that, though, too. But let's keep going. Okay. I'm... Oh, well, this place is a dead end. What's in here? Oh, this might contain something as soon as I get everything here. Oh, heart container. I'm getting nearly everything in this game. So one more heart container left, three items left. What else is left? Now I've already got past the bait, guys, so I don't need the bait. Small key. Okay, beautiful. Even better. And, I, and uh, that pretty much almost guarantees that I'm going to find everything in this dungeon. Thank goodness. Okay, so got to find the item. Got to find the... I hope I can find the map, though, too, so that way I can find all the rooms, uh, just in case I need to find the item, though, too. Okay. All right. Oh, I got three small keys, though, too, so beautiful. That'll probably help with the level 9 dungeon, though, too. Okay. Compass. Oh, wow, the Triforce is way over there, right at the top right corner of the dungeon. That's cool. That, that will work. So that does give me a few options with bombs, though, uh, regardless. Uh, nothing right there. That's fine. I got a lot of bombs, so I'm ready to I'm ready to spare some, which is good. Cause okay, so I got four options left. So I got to keep breaking into the top right uh, part of the dungeon. Good. I'm glad that the that the Triforce is kind of fanning out uh, where the rest of this dungeon is gonna go. I just hope there's not a shortcut. 
that goes from like the lower left part of the dungeon to the upper right because that would really suck okay so I got like four options here okay nothing right there okay good we got something let's go let's go oh shoot oh and he's got a small key though too Ooh, I got an idea to bring that small key over to my side though Let's see, um, I'm gonna try this, is I'm gonna go into there, and I'm gonna come back, and hopefully the mummy will actually just spawn right in my face. Yep, there we go. Ah, I love taking care, taking advantage of Nintendo logic. Okay. So that takes care of that, but now I'm back to, uh, scouring the place for another bombable room, but that's fine. I got another room next door, and that will get me something. I better. Because <laughs> I don't want to go shortcut hunting. Okay, so let's try this. Nope, nothing right there. Come on. Oh, you're got to be kidding me. Okay, so hmm, so we got to do some shortcut hunting, I suppose. Um, I don't think that there's anything there. So, but I do got to get some more bombs, though. Uh, probably. Okay, so we got to go shortcut hunting now, which means we got to find a room in order to get me into the upper right corner of the dungeon. Okay, uh, not without getting rid of those guys. Okay, so to, to, to do this properly, um, we need to start. We need to start bombing the left side. Okay. All right. So uh, yeah, we got to start shortcut hunting or wh whatever it is we got to do. Okay, dark nuts. Okay, let's see. Let's try that. Nothing right there. And then I gotta get probably get out of. Oh, I'm actually really close to the bombing farming spot too. So. There is that. Okay, first I gotta get these dark nuts out of my way. Okay, nothing right there. That's fine. Okay, so I'm out of bombs now. So I gotta get out of here. And these guys won't drop bombs. <laughs> Which is ironic because they're blue. Because they kind of like... Alright, so let's get out of here, which is to the right. And then I'm right next to the bombing ground. Okay, so let's grab some bombs really quick and then let's get... Oh, these guys drop bombs. Okay, it takes... Uh, nope. Uh, no bombs? Seriously? Uh, heart? No, not a bomb. Please get me a bomb. I need some bombs here. Oh, you're kidding me! Oh my gosh. What it takes to get bombs, right? I got four small keys, so I wonder if I should go purchase some. Oh, it's very possible. Let's see. Bomb? Bomb? Not a heart. I need bombs. Uh, you gotta love karma. The one time... The one time that I seriously need bombs, and then it just says, Nope, F you. Well, bombs are, like, super cheap, though, too, in shops, right? So I think one of these four places is a shop, so... Nope. Okay. That's not gonna work. Well, I probably wonder if I should start... Keep on farming for small keys or something, but uh, four small keys though, that's a pretty good way. That's some pretty good Leroy to get me into uh, Dungeon 9 though. I really want to get this done though. Oh man, seriously? Are you guys just going to keep on doing this like the entire time? Oh, well, we got a few blue enemies here, so. Ah, oh, fairy, no! No! I really don't like bomb grinding. I think you guys can tell. Bomb grinding really needs to... Oh, good. These guys have come back. Good. Four. Oh, four bombs. Well, it's better than nothing, I suppose. <laughs> and I can't believe I'm getting trapped like this. Uh... Oh, come on. No more hearts. Like the one time that like hearts are not very favorable to drop, all of a sudden I... Okay, so let's see. So let's head down, uh, and then let's go over to the right. That might be a good place to start bombing. Oh, are you kidding me? I gotta light up the room. Okay, um, okay, 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 I get it. Alright, 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 come on. Let's get this dungeon done. And if I don't finish this in time, then I'm probably just gonna fast forward it to the end, because, yeah, this is getting a little nuts. Oh, come on. All right, I think I might I think I might have to look up uh, what the dungeon actually looks like. 
Okay, so I'm gonna bring it up here really quick. So uh, give me one sec. I'll be right back. All right, welcome back. And uh, finally, I got the map here in front of me. So I, I don't want to be redundant because I really do want to finish this randomizer just like everybody else does. Because, like, yeah, seven parts and things, it's kind of dragging st stuff out. And I appreciate, like, that it's uh, pulling a big move on me to kind of hide the shortcut and stuff. But I really do just uh, want to get this uh, dungeon done so we can prepare ourselves up for Dungeon 9 next time. So, And besides, I don't want to keep on using bombs, like, all over the place. So, let's see. So, I'm looking at the map right now. I've actually uh, got it almost mapped out. It's just one more place I haven't explored yet. So I do know that um, that place over there to the right I can't get to because uh, the water, the moat and stuff, uh, it kind of makes it kind of rough. So let's see. So let's go into here. Okay, so we got it. But let's see. Um, according to this, there's a room here over to the right though. Oh crap. Um... That, I don't think that was supposed to happen. Let's see. Oh, there's one more to the north of me. That's why. I was supposed to bomb this place. Okay, there we go. Oh, I was thinking that I was in the very uh, top left corner, but nope. Okay, oh, I got a lot of small keys. Good. Uh, I can't overestimate myself, though, because last time I said that, then I ran out of keys all of a sudden just for this dungeon. Okay, so the Triforce is way over to the right. Okay, and I can find the item pretty quickly, though, too, in this fashion, now that I got the map in front of me. Oh, got the map. Oh, well, then I gotta see what's going on. There's a couple of statues uh, hurling fire at me. Oh, crap. I didn't mean to hurt myself that way. Okay. At least I can kill you in like two or three hits. Okay. So, I don't want to go immediately to the Triforce. Um, there are probably about five more rooms I haven't explored yet. So, let's see. So, let's head out down here and... Uh, oh, crap. I was, uh, I was supposed to get rid of those mummies, but nope, not going to happen. I think I wasted a key. Which wasn't good. Okay, but the Triforce isn't in this room, so I don't have to clear the room that time. Dig Dogger gazes close to start. <sighs> I know what he means, the starting location. Alright, so let's see. Oh! Okay, let's see. Is this the item congregation room? Because there are two more places left. Okay, this might be it. Please be the bow. Oh! Finally, finally, after eight dungeons, where did the bow happen to be in the fourth dungeon? And now the only items I don't have left is the orange candle and the master key, which is in level nine. So I do know what two items are hiding in dungeon nine. And thankfully I got enough small keys to get me started. Um, yeah, and then the orange candle. <laughs> Uh, the good news is that that hasn't been too practical throughout the whole thing, so. Alright, we got it. We are done. Oh, thankfully, that was... Uh... You know, like, after doing all of these eight dungeons, I'm satisfied. Like, well, like, I, I don't know. Well, like, at the same time, though, you can tell I'm tired, because, uh... Well, like, The Legend of Zelda on the NES is... It, it's one of those games where it's really fun... Like, don't get me wrong, super, super fun, super awesome game and everything. But it's kind of one of those games where after I play it for so long, probably about, mm, probably after about like five or six hours, which is about how many parts I've done about this, then it's, uh, it's pretty much, well, just, it's, it's time for me to put it down. Super, it's one of those, I like to come back and play every once in a while, but not something I just re religiously like play it over and over again. So that's kind of another reason I'm kind of anxious to kind of get this uh, one done is uh, it's fun. Like, don't get me wrong. Awesome game. Awesome Zelda game. Awesome. But uh, unfortunately, that's not my cup of tea after a whole lot of time. Oh, whoops, I went into Dungeon 6. I got a bit of time left. I'll probably explore like... I don't know, two or three rooms in Dungeon 9, and who knows? Maybe I can just happen to be lucky that I find Ganondorf, and uh, and then I'll find save Zelda in the same part. You never know. <laughs> Randomized, you know? Well, it is a big dungeon, though, like, regarding that, so... But you never know, though. Like, there's, like, a 5 or 10% chance that I could... Okay, good, I got a cleared passageway. 
But yeah, you never know though. Oh, got the fast moldworms coming my way. Okay, thankfully these guys like su go super fast. I'm actually not scared of the moldworms compared to other people. But, like, oh, maybe not a lot of people actually think about them. Let's see. Oh, this might be one of the item congregations. I sure hope so. Let's see. Will this get me a? Nope, it's a shortcut. One of the many shortcuts of Dungeon Nine. Let's see. Um, I got jinxed. Darn it. I'm so glad that it's not like uh, the second quest uh, with those jinxing, jinxing things. Is that the red things permanently jinx you until you hit a blue thing? And I remember it scared me to death in the in one of my let's plays because, yeah, no, I just didn't know about it. Like even resetting my game and getting back into the game world didn't solve the problem. Let's see, I think I'm in the bottom right corner, so I don't need to worry about bombing yet. Okay, and then this is where the small key uh, conundrum is going to start coming up. So I hope I come across the master key thing soon. Yeah, that would be really nice. I wonder if I should do this all in one part, but I don't know. It could take like up to a half an hour just to just to explore this place. So unfortunately, this is not the last part. I would really wish it was so I could move on to stuff, but uh, we got a nice little dungeon nine. Unless I can happen to come across Ganon on the, on the first few shots. Oh, crap. I didn't mean to do that. Well, thankfully, the like likes like cover me a little bit. Oh, I just got jinxed. Lovely. Ah, uh, just shoot that jinxing thing keeps on, keeps on coming by. To hey, stop jinxing me! Every time I feel like I I stop getting jinxed, he just comes on by. Holy crap! Those guys have a lot of randomized health in this place. Okay, it looks like I'm getting close to the end. Like, oh, is this an item congregation? No, it's another shortcut. So I gotta start mapping it. <laughs> I'm like really anxious to get this done. That's why I just want to keep on doing this. Oh, I went back to the... Oh, no, it's a different one. I thought it was uh, to the one earlier. And there are whiz robes here, too. Okay, um, there's no triforce any or anything like after I defeat these guys. So there's no point in uh, sticking around for the whiz robes. But... I do have a major hint now. Let's see, is that where Zelda is? No, I don't want to die though. I don't want to die though. Crap, okay. Let's see, uh, how far, how, oh, that is really close though. Oh crap, uh, you know what, I'm going to fill up my hearts really quick and then I'm going to go straight for that Triforce thing and hopefully that will be the last part. So I'm going to try that really quick and hopefully that will get me the results I want. So I'll be back in one second. If not, then it's obvious i got to look for Ganondorf or the such in order to get back. So I'll be back in just one second. Alright, uh, welcome back uh, everybody. So to kind of give you a ground report of what just happened is I refilled my hearts and then I used to, I got as close as I could over to the right side um, as I could. Oh, using this map right here and so I'm directly below the place in order for me to rescue Zelda which is like in this room right past here but I tried a bomb on it and actually in all three uh, parts of this room but unfortunately there were no bombable holes so it looks like the only way I'm gonna be able to get to it is if I use shortcuts or use another method in order for me to get over to where she's at and Regardless though, like in the Maelstrom difficulty, it was required of me to uh, defeat Ganondorf in order for me to, um, in order to get into the Zelda stuff. So, it looks like that this is going to be for another part. So, sorry about that. So, we'll have to do one more part of this and uh, that's okay. We're almost there though. So, just one more part. It's guaranteed. So, don't have to worry about it too much. So, I guess I'll see you guys with Zelda 2 and then we will get this done the next time. So, I'll see you then.